Hey you guys and welcome to my channel. So I am in the nursery right now. You guys can see some stuff in the background. It actually is quite a mess in here. I'm going to give you a little sneak peek of what it's looking like. So I just have like all sorts of things scattered around Eric's basketball stuff. Um, and the crib set up. Guys, the crib is set up. Um, earlier this week, I got a text from Eric. He works from home, and um, one morning he just like decided to put the crib together. And so I got a text, and there was a picture of the crib all set up. So that was really exciting. It was nice. Like I thought we would do the crib together, but I don't know. It was kind of nice that I didn't have to do it. Um, yeah, I thought maybe we'd do the crib together and film it, but you know, I'd rather it just be done. I really appreciate him doing that. Um, okay, so today, it's Saturday, we've just been like doing chores around the house, running errands, just got back, Eric's at um, a church meeting, so I just decided I'm going to go through the rest of all of this stuff here in the baby room and in the nursery, I keep calling it the baby room, and try and get some things organized and some things planned out for... I guess what we really need as far as right now. We have so much clothes and stuff, but I kind of want to like get a better idea of what we actually need. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. from Jessica and Ryan here on YouTube. Um, she just sent me a text while I was putting this stuff away, so I opened it, and I knew their gender reveal was this was today, but I like kind of got busy today and spaced it. And then I got her text, I saw her video, and she's having, well, I'm not gonna tell you. Go watch her video and find out what she's having, because I'm sure she'll do a gender reveal video. I don't know if it's already posted. If it is, I'll link it. Anyway, go watch their video. Go subscribe to them, and congratulations, guys! I'm really, really excited for you. Yay! guys I took a little snack break because man I am so hungry lately I'm 19 weeks one day and the past like week or two I am hungry all the time I'm always telling Eric I'm hungry and he's like big surprise you are always hungry lately anyway whatever so I had to have a snack break and I'll kind of show you what I've done so far as far as organizing the baby stuff all right I turned on the light because yeah, you couldn't see very well. So, um, I've put like some random gear right here and right here. This is like the boppy and baby carrier, a bottle warmer, um, just some things that I've gotten from baby showers so far. Diapers and wipes right here. I have um, one size one and newborn, and then a bunch of wipes. Um, 
And then just random toys. Okay, so most of this stuff, all this stuff was given to me. I have not bought anything, which is amazing. Oh, and I have a little bumbo, like, is that what those are called? Those little chairs? Anyway. Um, yeah, toys for my sister-in-law. Um, this bucket right here is like all, um, zero to three months, or like newborn to three months. And then like, basically, this is all clothes we have for the first year, I think. These are some random clothes that my cousins and sisters gave me sisters-in-law um I have to I've sorted through these I know I want to keep everything in here because I've already sorted through them um I just can't remember I think this is like 12 like one to two years old and that's like two to three year old clothes um I I really can't remember so I need to just label like put them all in totes and label them and maybe even put them in our storage room because I'm not going to be using those for a while um but we are just so lucky that we have so many people giving us stuff. Here's our crib, our little glider, um, the diaper pail. Guys, I'm telling you, we have not purchased one single thing. I think actually, no, I bought a little in the newborn or zero to three. There's like a little onesie I bought like years ago when we first started trying. Um, but that's it. So, and then I need to go through all these little baby shoes. Look at these cute little tiny moccasins. Um, and I've gone through these. I know I want to keep everything, but um, I need, because they all are really nice, like new shoes. I just need to sort them into like age categories, sizes and whatnot. So anyway, I'm going to do that now. All right, guys. I sorted all the baby shoes from smallest, like zero newborn, to about two and a half years old over here. Wow, we have a lot of shoes. And I hope that my little girl fits into like these boots when it's actually winter. Um, but oh my gosh, look how cute some of these are. So this from here to here is one year. She should fit in to them when she's a, like up until she's about a year old. And then um, she'll start wearing these. Which would be so cute because, like, look at how cute those are for summer. This will be a summer, well, May, baby. Um, yeah, so all these shoes came from my sister's in law and my sister Larissa gave me like these and these because her little girl um, just grew out of them. She's a year and a half. Um, and then my cousin Camilla gave me these two cute little shoesies for like newborn oh my gosh I'm so excited look at all these you guys and they're all in like pristine condition but a lot of them are basically new <laughs> look at these fun cowboy boots why not why not pink cowgirl boots seriously all these are new never been worn or some of them have been gently worn but yeah look how cute little fringe boots those are new too never been worn Anyway, so yeah, my girl, little girl, she's going to be styling. I love these ones too. Look how cute. Little church shoes. I love them. Girl stuff is just fun. Okay, you guys, I think I'm done for the night. I definitely can't do as much as I used to be able to do in one period of time. I get tired and um, yeah, so <laughs> my legs get sore and stuff. It's kind of pathetic, but that's pregnancy, I guess. So um, so I have organized the closet. I have organized all the baby stuff that we own so that I know what we have so that as we get new stuff, um, and start checking things off our registry, we will stay organized. Um, and then we can also start rearranging stuff in here in the nursery to get ready for baby. We can start decorating all that stuff. So I'm really, really excited. Let me just show you what I've done. All right. So when you walk into the nursery, this is what it looks like. Um, when I say that I have gotten everything for free, I mean it. Like, even this crib, we got for free. I may have told you guys that already. One of our friends gave it to us. It's in great condition. Um, and the mattress as well was free. Um, so we have some, uh, you know, I showed you the diaper pail. We have this, uh, rock and play. don't know if I showed you guys that. Um, but it's not the deluxe one, and I really want the deluxe one, I think. So my sister said she'll trade me. Um, for whatever reason. She's going to be babysitting my um, nephew. So she doesn't need the deluxe one all the time. So she, this one will work for her. So 
Anyway, I'm going to trade her. Um, and that was given to me by my cousin who didn't, who already had one, so she didn't need that one. So, crib, glider. We got to figure out where to put Eric's basketball stuff because it does not need to go in here. Um, okay, and then the closets right here. What I'm thinking, and you guys can let me know what you think in the comments. I want to put like a rack right here. Um, like just for some extra shelving. Um, because I'm only going to hang a few things up here, right? And that's plenty of space for her. Um, and then that way I can put like some bins to put like her, um, by the way, I know I say like a lot. It's really annoying when I watch these videos and I edit it. I'm like, oh my gosh. See, I say it so much. But anyway, so a shelf right there. Put some bins um, to put whatever, like clothes or bows or I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do, but just seems uh, better for storage purposes to have a shelf right there. And then you can put other things down there like diapers or whatever. Um... So we have all of her one year, zero to one year clothes there, toys. Did I already go through this stuff? I feel like I already went through this stuff. Pregnancy brain. Yes, I did. Up here is where I wanted to show you guys. Um, in here we have books. In here, socks, hats, and bows. In here, just random things. Like I got this like random pacifier and like a little washcloth thing that's super cute. It's kind of like a puppet too. In here are blankets, swaddles, um, uh, that sort of thing. Like nightgown swaddles. Not nightgowns, but like wrap-up swaddles. Okay, and then over here, this is um, one to two years. Like 12 to 18 months uh, clothing right there. This is 2T clothing. 3T clothing is up here. Oh my gosh. This is um, shoes. Oh, you can't really focus in on that but up there shoes um that are four to five size four to five and six to seven and then the other shoes I just put right here that are like um size zero to three so anyway so that's it oh and I wanted to ask you guys as far as this room goes I'm not quite sure yet exactly what I want to do I think I know what kind of theme I want but I'm not going to Day yet because I don't know if that's what I'm going to do but I'm thinking of putting the crib I'd rather have the crib over here so that when I walk into the room the crib's right there and then the glider maybe over here with a dresser that I can put the changing table on and maybe next to the glider do like a few shelves right here or right here for books um, I'd love to get like a rug to bring a little bit of I don't know, dimension into this room, and then maybe some curtains, probably some blackout curtains. You guys can let me know what you think about blackout curtains if you use those for your baby's room. Oh, baby, I am like out of breath. So I am done for the night. I feel really good about where we're at. We have so much stuff. I feel so grateful to just be set up already with so much. Um, yeah, so uh, that's pretty much it for today. I just wanted to give you guys a look into the progress of prepping, you know, the nursery and stuff for baby Cherrick, um, our little girl that is due May 4th. May the 4th be with us all. Um, I might start saying that at the end of all my videos because people keep forgetting my due date and we are big Star Wars fans so people should just know that this was meant to be. We are having our baby on May the 4th. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Um, I'll continue to bring you along with the nursery progress and then maybe just have like a full nursery reveal when we're ready. My goal is to be done with the nursery by 30 weeks. So we've got 11 weeks to go, which sounds like plenty of time, but I know it'll fly by. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you're not subscribed already, please go ahead and click the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up if you like this type of video. And I will continue to bring you along with all the prepping for Baby Trick. And I hope you have a great night, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.